We'll now start a new project inside 12D. On your desktop you should be able to find the icon 12D Model 10 and depending whether you're using the 64 or 32 bit version it will be also shown inside the icon. Double click on that. Once the project selection panel pops open you can click on new and we want to go to the folder that we're going to put the project into. So we click on the folder icon and we browse under workshops, design, intermediate road design and then you can click on select folder. We now need to give the project a new name and we'll just call it road design. You'll note as we type this in 12D is creating a working folder so where the folder will be called C12D10 workshops design intermediate road design and then the working folder road design and then the project name. If you don't want that working folder you can click off the create working folder icon and it will disappear. It's always best to keep this at this stage. We also want to create a environment configuration file and this will point to the folder that contains all our setup files used in this project. So under the registry file click on the folder icon and select open. This will open up the edit environment configuration panel and inside here we want to create our new intermediate road design configuration. So select environments and then click on the insert icon. We want to give it a new name and we'll call it intermediate road design and we need to find the environment file that points to the folders that contains all the files we require. So we can click on the folder icon and select browse then go to workshops, design, intermediate road design and under the user folder there we have a env.4d file. Double click on this one. All this file is is a text file if we open it up and if we scroll down to find the variables user 4D and user library 4D it's just pointing directly to those folders. We can now click on the right button in the top right hand corner and that will save this file and click finish. We can then select the environment configuration and select create to create our new project. Once the new project opens up, we don't require this setup project details, so we can just select set and finish, maximize plan view number one, and just move our recalc panel out of the way down to the bottom left hand corner of the screen.